The Josian Psychiatrist Season 2 is a horror story. Namaste Anyoseo guys, this is your favorite channel back with another video where we will review Season 2 of Poon, The Josian Psychiatrist. So before I start with Season 2, let me remind you Poon was a royal physician and a genius but he was expelled from palace and lost much of his fortune. He met Gaijiha and learns to help poor people. Season 1 was a good season overall, but its ending was a bit more full of twist. Like many other Josian K-dramas of kings and queens, its season 1 ended with the second state counselor Chutaihak being executed for poisoning the king. On a romantic shade, we saw Pong's lover Lady Seo transfer to a far island and the couple separated. However, season 2 starts with a boom and a lot of humor. And also there is a horror element to it. In episode 1 it starts with the spirit of Chotaihak haunting the people of the palace as many court maids end up sick because of this as they say it. However the actual reason is still known. The royal medical office suspect epidemic of food poisoning. However things take turn when Poo, Yosei Yop is called in by the king and he discovers another reason. They have conflicting views with the royal physician. However, with King's approval, he brings on his entire clinic team who really add a humorous shade to the drama and makes it enjoyable. Moreover, we see Lady Seo returning to Hanyang, now expert in medical skills, is eager to meet with Yoseo. The couple may unite and we will witness some romance. But wait, wait picture abhi baki hai mere dost, the royal princess also falls in love with you. Though it's one-sided for now in episode 1, but in later episodes, we will see a fierce battle of love triangle with Lady Seo and Princess fighting over Poom, Yo Se Yo. The season is going to get interesting with so many shades of history, medical kadrama, romance, horror and action too. I will definitely rate the season 2 of drama 4.8 stars out of 5 considering its plot and variety of shades brought in this season and definitely will be a good kickstart for Korean dramas in 2023. Tell us about your views and ideas in comments, and share your views whether you like historical dramas in comments. Do like, subscribe, and share the video. I will review other episodes of this drama as soon as they are released. Till then, goodbye. Thank you, Gamsamida.